In this video I will be demonstrating this beginner friendly kyanite fan pendant. This is the stone I will be wrapping. The measurements are for a stone of similar measurements. If your stone is bigger you will need longer wires. My base wire is 20 gauge soft round copper wire. Find the center of the wire. Turn the stone to the back. Bend the wire to an angle where the prongs will be best positioned at the bottom of the stone. Position the bend approximately a third of the way up the stone. Mark the wires where the bottom of the stone is. From the marks measure a quarter of an inch. My stone is quite thin at the bottom, but if your stone is thicker, increase the measurement. Make a tight bend in the wires at the lower marks. Near the bend, use any weaving wire to wrap the wires together. Wrap the wires together any way you wish, but starting and ending with the weaving wire going down between the base wires. Remove the excess weaving wires. Repeat with the other side. The side with the cut ends shall be placed against the stone when it is positioned. Slightly bend the very ends downwards. At the marks bend the wires 90 degrees. Place the stone in position so that you can see how deep the bottom of the stone is and where to bend the wires to the same depth.
approximately a third down from the top of the stone, bring the wires together. Now start weaving the wires together. You can use any weaving pattern you wish, this pattern is just a suggestion. Start with the weaving wire coming up between the base wires. Wrap twice around one wire, bringing the weaving wire back up between the base wires. Wrap twice around the other wire, finishing with the weaving wire behind the base wires. Wrap twice around both wires, finishing with the weaving wire coming back up between the base wires to the start position. Repeat the process. Wrap twice around the first wire, bringing the weaving wire up between the base wires. Wrap twice around the other wire, bringing the weaving wire to the back of the base wires. Wrap twice around both wires, bringing the weaving wire back up between the base wires to the start position. This pattern may seem complicated at the start, but you will quickly get into a rhythm. I have woven to the top of the stone and I will now remove the tail of the weaving wire. Bend the woven part of the wire 90 degrees to the side. Now bend them around to the front of the stone. Continue weaving. Bend the wires to the back and continue weaving to the center of the back above where the other wires bend. At this point, thread the weaving wire under the weave next to the bend on the lower wires and then continue to weave on the upper wires. Continue the process of weaving and bending the wires around the top of the stone.
When returning to the back, thread the weaving wire under the lower weaving wires and then continue the weave on the upper wires. Bend the wires to the front and extend the weaving. Start bending the wires into a loop above the stone. Extend the weaving to complete the loop. Bring the unwoven wires to the back. Thread the weaving wire under the woven wires below. Continue weaving a little further. Finish by bringing the weaving wire between the base wires with the end against the stone. Remove the excess weaving wire. Cut the base wire short and make a small loop. Repeat with the other wire, leaving it a little longer so that the loop sits beside the first.
Thank you for viewing. If you liked this video, please leave a thumbs up and please join me for my next video.